What I'm sick and tired of is all these magazines, newspapers, social media entities, whatever you want to call them, telling girls how they should look, telling them what, what, what weight they should have. Yes. All these, oh, size zero is the way forward. I am an African man. I like size 25. That's right. I want a woman with some, yeah. you know what I'm saying? When she's walking, I can hear her talking to me. You see, when I was watching Love Island, <laughs> When I was watching Love Island, I was just like, where are the big girls? Yeah. If I was in there, I would have been like, you need to bring a girl that, you know, yeah. that will cut off my arteries if she sits on my lap. You know what it is? We like a fight. We like a, <laughs> <laughs> we like, we like a struggle. We like to be colonised. <laughs>fashion brands have a variety of different body types now, mm -hmm. I've noticed. Their models are like normal size, mm -hmm. um, possibly still on the slim side actually, but like there is now more of a space for people to call companies out if they're not doing something yeah. positive. Companies are like, oh God, I do have to mm -hmm. adhere to this. Like, do you think it's better or is that, I mean, is that just me talking out of my ears? I think broadly it is a good thing. Broadly, obviously, if, knowing the alternative that, that it, is, it is a good thing. I can't pinpoint why it is that I became more comfortable with my body. My instinct is because I got more sexual experience, I've slept with more people, I've realized that these people don't care whether my calves look skinny. I guess in my mind, a lot of it was, this is what my body has to look like in order for me to have a happy sex life. And then yeah. I started having a happy sex life and my body didn't look like that. And then I realized, oh, well maybe it doesn't matter. Maybe uh, there is more room to be look, uh, deviate from that norm, quote unquote. So I think that gave me more confidence than let's say an ad campaign. But at the same time, ad campaigns are meant to act subliminally. So maybe I just can't pinpoint how Dove made me feel better about who I am. Yeah. But the second thing is that like, it is just so transparent that companies are just capitalizing on the body positivity. Oh, it's so lame. And, and yeah. a lot of it, I'm just like, yes, it's good, but it's also so fucking cringy. Yeah. Every time like Dove says brave when they mean ugly, or they mean, oh, say oh, real when they mean fat, and I'm just like, you mean fat. Yeah, just say, but, <laughs> but I do feel like the grossness will like subside, and then we'll be left with loads of models who aren't size zero, yeah. who yeah. have become popular through brands being like, we need someone brave. <laughs> a lot of people are realizing how much they fucking hate themselves. Oh yeah, no, no. <laughs> and they're like, wait, so I shouldn't? I feel like this is what's really this body positivity yeah. is all about, is people being like, oh, I'm okay. Yeah, I'm like. <laughs> I've been so body conscious yeah. for so long yeah. and I'm so, like, I've tried all different diets, I've tried all these, I've paid money to like get weight loss really yeah. quickly and have these body suction stuff and all these really, because I feel like, especially when you see stuff on like Instagram and yeah. video, music videos and like things that are posted and like magazines, yeah. it's just like, I'm not what people want to see and it's mm. just so like heartbreaking for me because there's no mm. one like me on a, yeah. on a media spectrum yeah. or like in telling front of you, this, this is okay. Telling you to get beach ready yeah, or telling like, you that you are beach ready. Yeah, and just being like, yeah. you are beautiful as how you yeah. are and I feel like that's ridiculous yeah. that how there's nothing out there that's really like that. Like for example, like, I went on a date uh, yeah. I went on like a blind date and this guy turned up and he was like, you are, f uh, I'm going to leave. And I was mm -hmm. like, what's wrong? He was like, well, you're fatter than you are in person than you were in your pictures. And I was like, right now, I just want to sit on your face so you understand how fat Check I am right off. now. So you understand, so I can Check suffocate me. you. Bow, 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 bow. Just like ridiculous. Like That's crazy. What's weird to me right now is that we're not currently conducting this meeting from a prison because that was murder worthy. Oh. I, I really could have killed him. I really wanted to suffocate him. Also, people forget that how I've got DNA, I've got black DNA. Mm. People seem to forget that how mm. I'm You're gonna have hips. I've got have hips. You're like, gonna have hips. It's in my DNA. Oh my God. Like I this was, uh, is yeah. not fat. This yeah. is thickness, bro. This is my body. This yeah. is this bum. Yeah. It's bloody like yeah. DNA. Like you should it's be happy shit. that I've got a bum yeah. in fact, actually. I look people like a fucking money. fertility sculpture. People pay money, ridiculous yeah. money. Go to yeah. Turkey and pay ridiculous I money for pay. this bum. As a person outside of your body, I appreciate that stuff. Thank you so much. Um, yeah. Mm, I appreciate your stuff. Thank you so much. Shall we get naked after this? Oh, maybe we should. Phenomenal. I feel like we're being sold so much more beauty products than we were. I feel like as we've taken a step towards like embracing in, a, in many ways different body shapes, 
our faces, I think, are getting more shit. Like, as in, like, <laughs> not as in more shit. Yeah, 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 yeah As yeah. in we're happy Because you know what? Everybody has so. a face. Let's make Everything them feel insecure face. about it. I don't know. I feel very bad for the young generation coming up now having to deal with that as if as your norm being like i guess i'm gonna have to have plastic surgery otherwise i won't look like that there's p people who are like 14 13 who are like i need to get my lips done or i need to have do you know what i mean before they've even do you know like conscious of ridiculous things where the the same the these role models now yeah do you know what i mean kim kardashian or whoever the hell these people one of are. the kardashians yeah and, and it's like i i honestly think that like stuff like that like they should be taught about it more in, in in school now. It should be a thing where, from a young age, you, you kind of taught that the way the world is on Instagram and the way people look isn't real life because it isn't. That I agree. But if people here cared about their looks more, they will all be in shape and will be healthy. That's how you get people to eat vegetables. You know, vanity. Yeah. To tell them you you're, you look like shit. People are judging you. Have a cabbage. I have I have a dead belly and I'm I'm, I'm happy as hell, bro. <laughs> but you know what? There's this pressure. I do believe it does go around because the same way girls have to have you know big boobs, big bums, all that stuff, right? Foundation upon foundation. You know they got layers. Like the face is here and the the powders comes over the way. But the guys is the same because there's all these pictures of of athletes or what looks good and the comments the ladies are putting on social media. Ooh, my husband. So a lot of guys feel that they want their attention, especially social media now. Your currency is likes. It's mainly um, like when you go to like holidays, isn't it? When you're on holidays and you see all the other guys ripped and stuff, oh. and then you got your dad belly just spilling oh. over your shorts, and like, you know what I mean? That's just, when the pressure's there. You run like. quickly, just dive in. Because <laughs> <laughs> you know those guys, they take the time when they're going in the pool. But again. I enjoy myself more on holiday because I get to drink. I know you don't drink, but I get yeah. to drink. I get to like really party and stuff. Them guys, they can't drink. They gotta eat a salad and drink water. Yeah, it's still you know what I'm saying? And, and they can't dance. Guys with mad muscles can't dance. This is the muscle man dance. Hey, baby. Hey, hey. This, this, this is it. They can't even smile. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> To so me, I think there is a lot of pressure though, because ladies react off that. We've seen it. Come on, we've seen the movies. Love Island, I think, is dangerous. Yeah. But this I is why I said if I was in there, if like I was it. single and I was in there, I'd be like, yo, where is the girl yo. that's a bit more, you know what I mean? Yeah, Where's even, the mean like girl? The, oh, look at Ovi guy, he was, became the perfect human, and look at his chiseled self, you six me? packs. And I would have walked in there like, <laughs> so who has made bacon for me today? <laughs>